we are going to be gracing you with a, a structure that you've never seen before. We're going to have two debaters leave the room so that we can debate a topic. Two debaters. Jeremiah. Bye. Bye. When Jeff and Jeremiah come back in, they are going to be debating a topic that they are not going to have any clue what it is. You're going to provide that for me right now. You're going to, you're going to help me build this topic. It's not going to be some easy topic like health care or, or immigration. It's going to be uh, a topic that we put together with what is, start, start shouting out some of your favorite adjectives. Migratory. Husky. husky. I love husky. Busty. Oh, I heard husky. Busty. 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 Busty's my favorite adjective. We're Pointy. Pointy and busty work well. Um, but I'm going to, uh, all right, I'll take busty. But uh, I'm very fond of husky. I wore husky pants at, at Kmart until I was like 12. But, um, all right, so we have busty. What is, um, what is an animal that you would find on a safari that's not a giraffe or a lion? Hyena. Hyena. I heard hyena. All right. Warthog's a very fine suggestion. So we have busty, hyena, and then what's your favorite gerund? Who? Word that ends in ing. I love saying that. What's your favorite ing word? Ping. Tripping. <laughs> Tripping. Tripping. Okay, so, okay. so we have. Spitting. Uh, very nice. Are you here with a date? Um, exactly, yes! <laughs> that was enough! Keep working that angle. Alright, so we have busty hyena tripping. Tripping. Busty hyena tripping. Okay, so we have our mind. We have our minds right here. They're gonna be mining clues to each debater one at a time, and they're they're gonna be timed. So they have to they have to guess their topic in order that they are debating. Busty hyenas tripping. Now, as they get close to guessing each word, start snapping your fingers. Now, when they actually get the exact words, start applauding and just go ape shit crazy. Okay, McIntyre family. All right. <laughs> So let's get our debaters back in here and get this debate started. Debaters! Choose your positions with the old standard Rochambeau. I am pro! I will be con! Con, turn your back. Pro, begin. All right, let me first start off by telling you that America is going down the tubes. And what we need here in America is a very tough, very tough uh, grassroots set. Very, very buxom. Uh, very, very, a very buxom group of Americans because Americans are slacking these days. And my opponent is going to tell you that he's against uh, very rough and, 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 and rough and tumble people, but he's... He's a, he's a liberal piece of crap, let me tell you that, all right? So that's why he doesn't agree. Switch! <laughs> now you notice that my opponent went instantly for slander for that. Uh, I'm not a liberal, I'm just a man who enjoys busty breasts as much as yeah! 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 You know what is a crime? Admit the policy this man's for. I am against any kind of busty wolf. Walking in like he knows what he's doing on Capitol Hill, and it's a dog. Like a real bitch about shit. <laughs> Alright, no, no. What we need is more busty uh, dogs. More busty dogs in America. More busty huskies. More busty chihuahuas. More busty... We need more busty, period. It doesn't matter what the busty is, but we need more of it. More... More, more busty uh, canines. The more busty canines, the better, I say. Uh, and with less busty canines, our economy is gonna go to shit. So, literally. <laughs> Are you hearing this guy? Busty this, busty this. He wants everything, but he can't have it. We need a smaller government, people, with less busty werewolves. <laughs> <laughs> They're harmful to the country. We need to get rid of all of them. They've been impeding our economy ever since busty, uh, hyenas. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
and they are tripping. Like this man wants, I will be going to Canada. The <laughs> con position has won. Please buy them drinks after the show. The pro position has lost. Please shun them at the bar.